During Buddha's time, he and his disciples would often travel from village to village, seeking enlightenment and spreading his teachings. In order to avoid burdening the households they stayed at, Buddha established a rule that his monks could only stay at one's home for a maximum of three days. This was a way to prevent the households from feeling obligated to provide for them. Despite this rule, Buddha and his disciples would often stay in poor households and villages for three days without any issues. At the end of their three-day stay, they would gather at the village square and continue on their journey. One day, as they were searching for a place to stay, Ananda, one of Buddha's disciples, was invited to the home of a prostitute. Ananda was hesitant to accept the invitation and asked Buddha for permission to stay. Surprisingly, Buddha allowed him to do so, which caused controversy among the other disciples, who believed that it went against the monk's code of conduct. However, Buddha remained silent and waited to see what would happen. During Ananda's three-day stay, the other monks spied on him and reported everything back to Buddha. On the first day, they heard music coming from the home. On the second day, they heard dancing. And on the third day, they heard singing and dancing. A few of the disciples believed that Ananda would not return. But what astonished them was not only his return, but also the addition of a new female monk to their group. All the disciples were puzzled, except for Buddha, who asserted that if one is confident in their actions and beliefs, they cannot be corrupted and may even inspire change in others. This story teaches us not to judge others based on their appearance or occupation. We should have an open mind and believe in the goodness of others. If we have strong willpower and remain calm and modest, we can resist corruption and stay true to ourselves. This is wonderful words of life motivation. Thanks for watching.